fellow cyber dogs and fellow minecrafters and fellow mine squatches all over the world. This is the Lockaba with the Lockaba presents Let's Play Minecraft 1.8 Hardcore. Minecraft Hardcore High Five in your face with an iron shovel. Alright guys, well, <clears throat> today is a good day but a scary day. Today we gotta make sure that our bow is rocking and rolling because I have come to an executive decision and that is as much as I hate the idea it's time to go to the nether yep yep oh I don't want to go to the nether you guys I can't even begin to explain to you how much I don't want to go to the nether but I can't keep trading away all my emeralds for glowstone there's many other good things that our villagers have and so I guess it's time I'm bringing a whole pile of cobble let's just take a look here I'm bringing a whole pile of cobble so that hopefully I can make us a little a little hidey hole here in the nether before we set to the process of uh, collecting glowstone but I have got my Squatch bow, my Uber bow. It's a great bow. I caught it fishing. If you haven't seen my previous episodes, I caught it fishing, and it is an awesome bow. But we have got such great glowstone clusters up there. I just, we, we gots to, gots to. We gots to, gots to. So, I'm going to be very simple. Ow. I gotta stop doing that though. I didn't bring any food with me. Ow. We just want to get ourselves set up with some simple cover. Oh lord, he's right there. Oh, was that a shot or what? Just want to get us set up with a very simple straightforward place where when we come in we can have some security and nothing fancier than that right now just like this Really should have brought some food. Kapoink. There we go. Well, it makes all its scary evil noises. There we go. Alright, now. Do we go back and get some food? Ah, like my dear departed father used to say, if you're gonna be a bear, be a grizzly. Time to go up and get that glowstone cluster right there. Let's get right directly below it. And there we go. And let us hope that Gasty and Gasty Jr. and Gasty Sr. and everybody else stays the heck away while we work our way up here. And let's especially hope that we don't get a frame lag and get pushed off of our column. Oh, okay, here we go. From here we should be relatively okay. Let's just let it drop right down there. And we will collect it when we get to the bottom, because I don't want to be up here long. Ye old shift key. But yeah, I don't want to keep trading away our emeralds for something as easily accessible as glowstone. We're going to bust this, we'll go down, pick it up, alright, very, very, very carefully, make sure and redo our shift key here. go 
now. Carefully ever. Oh, don't throw that away. We need that. <laughs> Sorry, I'm a little nervous. I think a little nervous. Oh, I almost busted that right out from underneath my feet, guys. Might as well bust this out and let it drop as well. Come on. We got to get back down there before that glowstone despawns, but... Oh, lordy, there he is. <laughs> wow. He just came floating out of nowhere. All right. Let's get down from here. Lord, let's get down from here. A little more forward. There we go. Go down and collect this glowstone, this XP. We might even have a gas tier over there. Let's go. Pick this all up. Get away from me, pig face. I'm trying to decide whether to go up there and... Whoa, they are just... Look at him rise right up out of there. Oh, we vanished. Where'd he go? Did he despawn? Oh, there he is. Come on, floating back out. Come on. He must be, like, right at the border of rendering or something. The way he keeps flashing in and out. Oh, man. Now I gotta be careful over here I don't get set on fire. Just looking to see if maybe we can spot that gas tier. Not on the soul sand. We don't need to be slowed down like that. Wow. Well, let's see how much glowstone we got out of the deal. Oh, we got a lot. We got a lot. And we also got enough of this to make daylight sensors if we so desire. Hopefully there won't be a lava flow. Alright, grab that. Sure wish I knew where he was, because we can't not dare go up. Again, until we take care of him. Where did you go, sir? Get this. And might as well come get this. I mean, we're getting a nice pile of it, and it's giving us some good XP. Just got to be very careful about where and how we mine, just in case lava flows. Alright, well given the fact that we don't have enough food to heal and that we've got a gas lurking out there I think I am going to come over here and mine just a little bit more of this and maybe get a look at what we got close by This could get us up to 30 levels, which would be pretty awesome for going back and doing some enchanting. In fact, we're very close to 30 levels. Just got to be real careful for the lava. Oh, do we got to be careful for the lava. Because I've done that more than once. <clears throat> Been mining this stuff and just casually mined out some lava above my head. Come on. Just a couple more and we're to 30. Oh. Nope, not going to happen there. Let's grab this stuff, make sure we don't miss it. Come on, there's got to be a little more nether quartz right here someplace. Here we go. Be careful I don't end up looking upwards. Aha, there we go. That's too high to reach. Good enough for me. Yeah, with that gas sneaking around out there, I just don't really feel comfortable getting back up there and 
mining more glowstone. And I mean, we've got plenty enough to complete our upstairs at the moment. And I don't see... I don't see a fortress anywhere close by. Yeah, I think that's enough of a trip to the nether for me. Yep, yep, indeedy do. I will get this. Since it's right there. Ah, oh, you guys are just, like, all hanging out, aren't you? Yep, alright, that's good enough for me. At this moment, I'm gonna step over here and get back to my bow. Just step over here and see if we spot him. I don't see him. Urgh, this is a tough call, guys. Because I just... Uh, it makes me so nervous. Me and the nether do not get along at all. Alright, well, let's head on back. We don't have food for healing. Ah, and see, he was, he was out there waiting for us. I think we made the right decision. I think we did, we did. Alright, head back on up. There we go. Up we go. Ah, there we go. I mean, so that, that got us... You know, it is so weird because the chickens are always carrying on like that. And in my experience, growing up on a farm, the only time that chickens are constantly carrying on like that is like when there's a fox or something trying to trying to get at, at the chickens. So it always makes me weirdly nervous when I hear them. All right, well, let's head on in the house. Come on in here. Let's see how much glowstone we managed to get. Should be enough to get us rocking pretty good. Yeah, well, there you go. That right there saved us 11 emeralds. That's nothing to sneeze at. We'll put the extra in here. Now, when we build our upstairs here, we can do some glowstone in the ceiling, too. Yeah, buddy. All right. Well, I need some sand in order to be able to do the rest of our glass here. I, I've been thinking about just, like, building up some glass columns and fill, doing this all solid glass. Making it just this amazing, like, sunroom, you know? That could be really neat. Could be really, really neat. We'd only need... Well, we need a lot of glass blocks, honestly, to do it. We'd have to do another layer of panes going up and then do glass blocks on top. And I think maybe instead of these solid blocks of glass, we would use our dark oak instead. So that it looks properly supported. Ah, the beautiful sunrise. I'm going to have you guys hold on just one second here. I was just checking to see how much recording time I've got left. <clears throat> We've got about seven minutes, so I think what we shall do, we shall go down to the river and police up some sand. Now that the sun has risen and we don't have to worry about the mobs, the mobs. There should be plenty of sand down here. Are you guys over here harassing my villagers again? Or we must we must have zombies down in the cave again. Yep, we must have zombies down in the cave. All right. Well, because of our amazing, oh so amazing helmet and shoes and things. We can come down here and dig sand like crazy at high speed. Just walk along the bottom and I'm just gonna collect it right from here. I just gotta remember to come up for air occasionally. So 
like now. Uh, there we go. And make sure that we don't dig out the sand that our, uh, uh, as I was just about to say, the sand that our sugar cane is growing on. I'll have to replant that at the corner here. And I'm breaking the shovel. I'll have to replant that one. It's mare. Uh, there we go. See how much sand we got there. Wow, yeah, we got to definitely get some food happening. Okay. Um, over here. There we go. And over here. Here, we got some clay here too, which I didn't realize. Get some air. And now the sand out of the bottom. Get some air. There we go. But yeah, this, this Aqua Affinity um, helmet and Depth Strider boots, along with uh, a little bit of breathification, that sure works dandy. Let's see how many we got now. There we go. We got more than two full stacks. That's plenty good. Oh, what the heck? Wow, we had a whole nother stack of glowstone there, I didn't realize. All right, well, let's get our, our replanting done here quick. There we go. By golly, we got more sand we can get right here. Let's get as much as our uh, shovel will allow us to get. Sand up here, All right? Yep. Grab a little air. we have wow look at that it's so so much slower doing it from up there isn't it and it looks like we'll have to replant one of our our guys here but we need to get some, well ooh and that's ugly don't want that don't want that. Well, I am so pleased to find out we've got a whole other pile of glowstone there. All right, let's head back on up here. Come on, hop up there. There we go. And go on in. Let's get this cookifying. go put that in there put that in there put that in there and put that in there and then we're gonna have to uh, see if we got a little more coal going in some of these here oh as a matter of fact that one doesn't have any coal at all and see coal we had coal, where would we have put it? No coal in there. No coal in there, no coal in there. Hmm. In fact, I don't even have any raw wood. No coal in there. Wow, am I out of coal? I could be. Oh no, I was going to say, I was sure I had at least a whole nother stack of coal. 
So let's uh, split this off. Oh, excuse me. Let's split this off. Stop being a pain in my butt, please. There we go. Let's put that off. So that's charcoal. So what we'll do, so we'll switch that. That's charcoal. So we'll switch that. And that's coal. So we're good there. And it's charcoal. So we'll actually just charcoal that in. And this one has nothing in it. So we're just going to stick this coal in here. And that way, in the future, if we got something to cook up, we're good to go. And so now, let us do this. Kablam! Look at that. Wow. So that's way more glowstone than I thought. I thought it seemed like a small amount in comparison to how much we had knocked down, but hey, I wasn't going to complain because, like I say, I still was saying, hey, that's 11 emeralds, but now that's much more than 11 emeralds. Holy cow. That's, well, let's see. That's just, I believe that's 19 emeralds that we have saved. That's awesome. All right, well, we got the glass going. We have managed to successfully get some glowstone. And we are going to be able to now do the glass work up above. And I think that's what I'm going to do. I think I'm going to use my dark oak to do the supports. And I'm going to make that a completely glassed-in room up there, maybe. Maybe, just maybe, we'll do it that way. We may actually end up having to do a wooden ceiling. I don't think we got enough glass to do that. We'd have to go and dig a lot more coal to... Or coal. We'd have to go dig a, a lot more um, sand to make it number one. And number two, we'd be using up a lot more coal than I'd really like to use up. So I think probably that's what we'll do is we'll glass it in all the way around, maybe two layers, maybe even three layers high, and make it a big, beautiful glass wall up there, and then do a really neat pattern ceiling with glowstone and cool stuff. Maybe we'll do some glowstone in the corners or something, I'm not sure. But one thing I do know for sure is that we are out of time for today. So I'd like to thank you for joining me, the Lakaba, for Let's Play Minecraft 1.8 Hardcore where we made a brief but scary trip to the nether and did some killer shots on some ghasts. Ooh, are we an archery beast? All right, guys. Well, thank you so much. I'm going to go find myself something to eat before I perish. All right, I'm out. Here's the Minecraft high five with a right hook in your face. All right, I'm out. Peace.